too high. Okay, let's set it up for up close view. Looks like the extractor has it, good tension from the ejector, pulling it back and throws it out with no problem. Let's reset, let's look at it again. Under the extractor, drops. Hmm, that's interesting. Let's set it up and do it again. Pulling it back immediately is not engaging or dropping off almost immediately. So that is definitely a clue of where to start looking for the trouble. Let's check the bolt head. Correct bolt head size, ME. Bolt face looks good. Extractor looks good. No chips or cracking. Hold on one second. Take a look at that plunger. See a small stone impinging on it? probably locking the whole thing up and keeping the brass from seating correctly. So what's the takeaway? Well, for me, I'm definitely gonna to have to pay more attention to the wax that is on this GP11 ammo. I understand it's possibly a water seal and some people seem to think it eliminates erosion in the barrels, but the reality is here in the Midwest where it gets really hot, if it's 90 plus degrees, that wax gets all over your fingers, it gets all over the brass, and possibly get inside your gun, which would make it easier to pick up or retain FOD. Lesson learned, I'll be watching out for this in the future.